Good afternoon to you. I'm Susan Dinkle. It's Thursday, April 6th. When severe weather strikes, people worry about many things, including the safety of their pets. The tornado on Friday just barely missed the Robinson Hospital for Animals. News 10's Blake Dollier joins us now live. He explains how this has made for one very hectic time for the hospital. Blake. Susie, this building right behind me is the Robinson Hospital for Animals. And if you take a look, I'll step aside. You can see that it was virtually untouched by the tornado that went through this area. And as you know, the Lincoln Trail College South Campus, which is just about a quarter mile down the road from me, was completely destroyed. Let's take a look at that video. This is just, as I said, about a quarter mile from where I was, where I'm standing right now. Staff at the Animal Hospital say they're incredibly lucky to have gone untouched. While well, the hospital wasn't directly impacted, several animals were. Staff say right now they're taking care of three displaced animals. They also say they've taken in some others throughout the week. Some people have even brought in animals just to have them safe from debris while they clean up. Clinic manager Kristen Drisco says that's good as she's seen pets come in with injuries from debris. As soon as they notice anything, um, let us know, you know, with the debris, so, you know, up and about probably in fields that they didn't get where maybe the cat roams or the dog roams around. Um, you never know, you know, they might step on something or, um, you know, get scratched on something. Now, if you're concerned about your pet, you can call the animal hospital or message them on Facebook. Now, I hope you stick with us at six o'clock because I have an interesting story to tell you about what the staff here at the animal hospital was going through their mind as they heard the tornado was just missing their workplace. Reporting live in Crawford County, Blake Dollier, News 10.